this is one that I made in my previous video and it's so cute it's just a little um, box that I made and you can fill it up with some gifts send it to your friends but it is so adorable it's such a pretty house I want to live here and I want to have sequins in my window as well I think it's so cute so there's that then I have these cute little bags here and it is this little handbag um, die this one here and I created three tropical summery handbags and these are really cool because they're really flat so I'm gonna be sending these in happy mail in um, flat mail so your mail doesn't get too bulky so these ones are perfect for that so I'm gonna start with this one and um, the collection I use for this for this set is Dear Lizzie um, here and now so this is the first one it's really cute it has a little handle and if you open it it's just like a little flap here um, and then you can fill it up with some goodies so this is, I think this is just perfect for happy mail and of course you can extend the sides a little bit if you push them down so it gets a bit um, wider but I think having it flat like this is just perfect for happy mail so this is the first one and then we have this gold one here, this is really pretty. This looks really glam, I love it. Again with the little handle, I've got these cute little um, um, embellishments here. It's like, you know, the button of a handbag. And this one's really cute, I love these little um, ephemera pieces here, or stickers. Yeah, I think they're stickers and some of my favorite enamel dots. And again, if you open it up, just a cute little, little pocket. And yeah, I think these are just so cute. I absolutely love them and then there's this one with a very sparkly handle and some bright pink accents here pretty sunglasses some flowers I like and I wanted to keep these uh, like you know in a tropical theme because of the paper and I think these are so cute and I cannot wait to fill these up with some pretty goodies so these are my three little handbags that I made and then I have used this really cool nesting die set so you get five dies in five different sizes and I have this really cool pattern on the side. So let me show you what I made. Um, I have made a little mini album, mini flip book. Um, it's some of the book with, um, I think the the second largest um, circle. Is it that one? Yes, it is. Um, it's the second largest circle. So I just cut out a whole bunch of circles and created a little mini album. So I used um, I think the paper pad is called All Summertime by Pebbles. It's an older one, but it's really pretty. And the ephemera pieces I used, I've um, actually used quite a few collections, so I'm going to tell you what I've used um, once we go through this. And then I've decorated both sides. So this first one is very simple. It has this um, very, like this newspaper type patterned paper on the back. And I just stuck down one of these beautiful Sweet Story rosettes by Maggie Holmes. And on this side, we have lots of mermaids, and I think they're so cute. I used one of the stickers, and I don't know if you can see it, but I did, I did some stitching, like zigzag stitching around all of them. I um, should have used maybe a darker pink, but because you can't really see it on here because it's kind of the same color, but I think it still adds, adds a little bit of texture to it, which I think is really cool. And the next page is really bright. Um, there's this really beautiful flower pattern, but it's quite busy because of all the different colors. Um, so I decided to stick down this massive die cut piece that says Hello Sunshine um, but you can still see the pattern which is really cool and the yellow kind of matches with the sunshine and I thought that was really cool and also there's that glitter on that paper which is so cool then this one this is just um, you know a scene with lots of people swimming in the ocean and I've got this um, beach towel that says Beach Babe I think that's really cool and a very pink page I have to have something like super pink in here right so we've just got this pink polka dot paper, a really pretty um, circle die cut piece and I've just got some gold thread behind it. I mean there is some holographic foil in here, also some glitter, but because the um, I've, I've got eyelets on every single page and the um, binder ring is gold as well, I thought I can use gold thread and get away with it. Um, this page is this really pretty um, blue paper. I think it's supposed to be like waves and I don't know if I stuck it down the wrong way but it still looks really cool. And we've just got some laid up embellishments here. And then on the last page I had to use this lobster paper because it's so cute. Look at them. Love them. And I just stuck down this, this cherry. I thought the colors kind of matched. And this is it. 